Hey everyone, Brandon here from IW Hockey, here to do an overview of the CCM Tax AS5 Pro Shin Guard. So we have a traditional fit profile, meaning you're getting maximum coverage and protection, but with some great mobility too. And then for the level of play, this is an elite level design. So this is really geared for that highly competitive elite level player or anybody who's really just wanting the best protection and coverage in a CCM Shin Guard. So starting off on that exterior, we've got a two-piece construction with that hinge at the kneecap. We've got a tape groove down on the top of the shin guard that's gonna help your sock tape do its job and keep the sock secure to your shin guard. And then down low, we have an anti-abrasion patch here. So if you wear your shin guard underneath your skate tongue, that's gonna help reduce wear and tear. Now, for that protection package up top in the kneecap is a mold of plastic designed with JDP technology. This is gonna disperse big and heavy impact energy away from the knee joint and into the surrounding foam. And that foam is D3O. So this is CCM's premier foam at handling big impacts, whether it's a collision with the boards, a player, or the ice. So JDP will disperse it, and then D3O will absorb it and dissipate it as well. So an elite level protection package up in the knee. Up in the thigh, we have a, a molded EVA foam super lightweight, reinforced with a plastic insert, so it's not gonna absorb water, and as well, it's gonna uh, do a good job of keeping you protected. This is designed with CCM's flex motion design, so this is just really gonna reduce the interference that you would have with your hockey pant. And then for their knee wing, this is a compressed molded HD foam, super lightweight again, but super protective to the outside of the knee. And then down below that, we've got an injected molded plastic with D3O foam again, solid coverage from top to bottom, but elite level shot blocking protection with that rate sensitive D3O foam. And then for your shin cap, we've got a rib molded plastic design, gonna disperse impact energy away. And then they added D3O foam in the bottom portion of the shell here. So once again, more shot block protection or slash protection or whatever it may be. So from top to bottom, this is the shin guard to get if you are wanting that maximum coverage and protection. For your strapping system, we've got a one inch Hyper X lock strap. It's gonna have a comfort padding. It's attached deep inside the liner, so it's gonna be nice and close to the body, keeping that knee nice and locked into that donut. Down low, we have a dual elastic nylon strap. This is length adjustable, so no matter your calf size, you're gonna be able to dial in that fit get that coverage close to the body and it's going to reduce that pad from twisting around on you. Now finally as we head into that liner a very unique feature we're going to see this year we've got their Adaptive Fit Plus so it's a sublimated design nice and soft and comfortable laminated so it's going to wick sweat and moisture away from your body. We've got a knee cut out here where it's going to add dense foam around the knee giving you added comfort and protection but unique to this feature is the way that it's adjustable. So it's gonna match your skating style. So if you wear uh, the shin guard over top of your skate tongue, you're gonna have this bottom portion of the liner up top where it sits. Now, if you wear your shin guards underneath your skate tongue, go ahead, adjust this piece, move it down. That way this protection is closer to your body. You're gonna eliminate gaps in protection and just secure an overall better fit. And then you do have adjustability up top in that thigh piece as well. So this is adjustable with a Velcro system. So go ahead and dial in that fit, ensure that protection stays where it needs to be and giving you a good fit all game long. Overall, if you're looking for any more information though, you can hit the link in our description below. And while you're here, give us a thumbs up on the video and be sure to subscribe to our channel.